So I've got the little basil starts up here at the house. And they're about ready to go out to the big bed. Hey, so I'm out here in the basil greenhouse. And I'd been working on the far end of the basil bed where I needed to finish up, you know, turning it over all the soil to make it uniform. And then I'd put seaweed on the top and then a little bit of soil right on top of that. Kind of like I did with the rest of this bed. So I just need to finish that up and then I need to move on to uh, this bed right here and do the same thing. Okay, so I've got that far end turned over and finished with the drip line out and... I've had these little extras of basil sitting around my little in soil blocks from the last batch. I didn't have room for them. So I'm planting them out and I feel really bad because they're so unhappy. So anyway, I decided to go ahead and get some drip on these little guys and the rest of the basil and also the cucumbers. So I am just going to dig out this very end here and put it in the wheelbarrow. So then I have a trench. And then what I do is I just turn things over into that trench, and then I have a trench, and then I turn things over into that trench, and I go all the way down the bed. Okie doke, so I've got my last trench right here been mixed and I just need to put the old uh, soil in the wheelbarrow back in here. I'm putting rotted seaweed in this section and then I just bury it with some dirt over here. So then when I plant the basil in, the basil gets planted in and their toes kind of go down in it. And that worked really great last year for the basil. So, got it all done. And, uh, it's raining again. Done for the day. I changed my shirt to a different blue shirt so that you would know that it is a different day. And, um, I wasted most of the day. I, um, I've been having a hard time. <laughs> I didn't know that there's such a thing as racist vegans, but there are. And so I've been super bummed. In fact, I secretly made a whole video about it. I was like, blah, 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 this and blah, 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 that. And then I was just like, delete. <laughs> but anyway, today everything's better because I was watching a video by Mike the Vegan and, uh, which I will link above and below. And he was all like, uh, Black Lives Matter, he said. And I'm like, you go, Mike the Vegan. And uh, I read the comments, and of course he gets like thousands of comments. And it's just like so many vegan racist comments. And I was like, oh my gosh. But the jolly thing was is that my buddy Mike the Vegan, with so many people being so silent about stuff and not saying stuff, and I just thought, everything's better. Mike, Mike for president. If I hadn't already made a video saying that we need to not vote for third parties, I would do like a write-in of Mike the Vegan. Anyway, so I was really happy about that, but then I was reading through the comments and I wasted hours like... That's not true. That's, that's horseshit. <laughs> yeah, so now I'm coming out to the greenhouse. All I need to do is lay out the drip line on this bed. Anyway, and I was thinking, I cannot plant the basil out in this, like, high 40-degree weather at night and 50-degree weather during the day. I mean, I just can't do that for my poor buddies that have been sitting up in 70-degree weather in the house. They're just gonna have to deal with it. It is so humid in here. I'm so afraid of getting a mildew issue. But the one thing I was gonna do, besides all that, all that little stuff I'm gonna do today, is I was gonna do a sun dance. And um, I even have a costume. So I'm gonna change in my, into my costume and, and then we're gonna do a sun dance because we need some more sun. How do you like the costume, huh? Okay, 
What are we going to do? Is it going to be a serious sun dance or a silly sun dance? Let's do a silly sun dance. And wouldn't it be epic if the sun came out while I was dancing? <laughs> change when you can just uh, work in your costume. <laughs> so I have my drip line here and I really should figure out a way to roll this up a little bit better for the winter time because it's all kind of goofball. Okay so these little fellows are a lot easier to deal with once there's water going through them so I'm going to turn on the water. Oh my goodness, it totally worked. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, it totally worked. Oh, it totally worked, man. Hey, so I got my one job done for the day. I'm really proud of myself. <laughs> so the sun came out, but then it went away. Just teasing us. Here are my pretty little fellows that I'm gonna plan out today. Pretty. Hi. So, oh my gosh. In some ways it might just be easier if I just use my hand instead of this trowel. So the reason I'm planting multiple successions of these guys is because what I found in the past is that, oh gosh, how do I do this? <laughs> um, <laughs> Uh, is that the new shiny stuff, you know, by the time I've got that growing, the older stuff might be looking a little raggedy. And um, so it's kind of nice to have a new fresh thing going because I haven't had any problems with them like bolting a seed or anything like that. Um, so yeah, we're going to try that. Um, things are not growing. They're not looking anywhere near as nice as they were last year, and so they're just not filling in. 
Okay, so I got this end planted, and we're going to go over here. And as you can see, so it turns out that I've got um, enough here because of my wider spacing that I've chosen that I'm almost filling a little bit more, actually probably than two thirds of this bed with basil. So I started out thinking I was gonna do four successions of basil, then thought, you know, I'm gonna run into it being too late in the season with my last succession. So I thought, okay, I'll just do three. And then now it looks like I'm gonna be doing just a, a little over two, right? Um, that's okay, I guess. Uh, yeah. So I've got a bunch of videos that I'm thinking about making so that one that I made on racism in the vegan movement and then I just deleted it because I just like thought it was kind of rambling and whatever and I probably should go ahead and do that one because you know I make kind of a little bit light of how I've been feeling but I've been really wrecked <laughs> just, like, just um, really disillusioned you know and then as far as like gardening videos besides my regular blog I need to start thinking hard about like selling. Um, how am I going to sell this direct? I've kind of just got some basic ideas, you know, but, um, you know, cause and I've got stuff coming on, like my radishes are gonna come on faster than my my, um, green, my lettuces and stuff. And so it's like, what am I gonna do? Drive 10 miles out to deliver one bunch of radish to, you know, to somebody? and you know payment and packaging and all of that which I just gotta get that kind of figured out so I really need to kind of do a video on that so that'll be super boring I've got the little guys planted over here and the big guys trying to grow over here so I think I'm gonna call it a week and I need to start thinking about how I'm gonna sell this stuff when it's when it's ready you hear that that's rain. But it doesn't mean that my sun dance didn't work because the sun is gonna come out eventually. Here's my little deer friends. Oh my gosh, I got a mosquito trying to bite my finger. Da 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 da. 